today i will show you a sneak peek on this book everyday love by sharmila ribado uh, the title of the book is a mother's guide to healthy cooking for kids kids so yeah uh, i heard somebody i i think it's from instagram that i heard the recommendations for this book and this is what it is it's, it's a most of a um, it's an indian i should say that there is a lot of indian dishes which makes it uh, you know more uh, you know which was why i thought i'll take it but there are some few continental and uh, other dishes also so if you see some of this is breakfast is um, boiled egg chilli chos idli dosa variations potato masala uh, vegetable sambar gun powder moong dal pesar to besan chilla so then even there are uh, american ones also american style pancakes um uh, then granola bar uh, classic french crepes uh, then there are a lot of ideas for lunch box chinese fried fried rice kaukas uh, then uh, then bread and soup soups also there every day bun wall wheat loaf bread then after school snacks uh, pani puri jaljeera masala popcorn yeah cold drinks homemade fast food some uh, pizza kind of thing then there are treats chocolate cake fudge cake uh, apple strudel cake um, buttery birthday cookie then yeah so baked mishti dal okay so these are the few things okay yeah uh, maybe uh, when i look at it on one glance i feel that okay there could have been more um, after school snacks because that is some little more ideas could have been helpful but i think uh, most of these these items this breakfast items can be um, you know uh, like french crepes um, all those things can be used as a um, after school item also so now if you look at the books uh, she has written lot of about with the vitamins that is required what are the uses then then uh, maybe one important page is the way to fruits and vegetables so um, so one point is vegetables can be hidden and uh, uh, fruits that are visible are eaten more often than hidden in fridge um so yes um then few is about eating nuts and seeds um so uh, then this is about the food intake uh, or the net energy requirements in kilocals for age for kids actually and uh, then uh, yeah so uh, i find uh, i see i have not read this book uh, maybe even i have not read few pages but i have just gone through it but i find some some of the few very interesting ones like like easy peasy peanut butter i i had not thought about making peanut butter at home but see she has a very good easy recipe here then nagpur orange marmalade i would love to make that one day because those are the things that i always think we we may not be able to make then green chutney mayonnaise yes mayonnaise i think there are a lot more uh, uh, recipes available to make mayonnaise nicely uh, then glucomole and um, this is american style pancakes um, i hope i'm not going to fast that you can see all and you can see these all these beautiful uh, photos also that that is their part of this book then this is about making misli then yeah there are two pumpkin muffins and strawberry muffins i think i still have i i'm not a big fan of pumpkin maybe it's because only i have eaten it in the kerala dish called edisheri maybe that's the only time i have eaten pumpkin maybe it's time i take my own version towards it and throw it in the dustbin maybe i can experiment with some of these then this is of course our curd rice then she has a session on breads and soups loaf bread dahi puri aam panna chicken burger Mm, mm, sorry i i don't want to try pronouncing that it is something continental i don't know as such okay so even treats she has marble cake here um lemon curd cake and this is mary biscuit chocolate coated mary biscuit okay mango sorbet and yeah 
then some back to ba- basic some she has some changora kheer i don't know what exactly is that yeah so that's the book okay so this is this is the this is the back part of it so i got this book uh, from amazon and it has been sitting in my shelf for few days i hope i'll be making use of it soon and cook something for cool for my kids yeah thank you for watching